Donna asks, what inspired you to write the Left Behind books? My agent introduced me to Tim LaHaye back in the early 1990s, uh, right after he signed me. He had signed Dr. LaHaye a little bit uh, before he signed me. And uh, he asked me if I'd ever met Dr. LaHaye, and I had not. I had published Dr. LaHaye's columns in a magazine I had edited a few years before. And of course, everybody was aware of Dr. LaHaye. He was a well-known nonfiction writer, a bestseller, and a well-known pastor and speaker and minister. And uh, I was eager to, to meet Dr. LaHaye. My agent said uh, he was a nonfiction writer with a great fiction idea, and I was a novelist with no ideas, so he thought it'd be good for us to get together. Um, Dr. LaHaye and I hit it off immediately. He was the age my parents were before they passed, and uh, I respected my elders. I loved the idea that he had. He said he'd been uh, writing about prophetic uh, scriptures and prophecies um, long before I had been born and uh, had written a lot of nonfiction things about that, but everywhere he looked, he'd seen people reading novels, and he thought if he could get somebody to write fiction based on his views of scripture, uh, that it would be uh, successful. And so um, he wanted to minister much more widely. So um, I had grown up in the same tradition as he had, and I believed the same way he did it, even though I'm not a theologian or a scholar. Um, so I wrote up a... Um, Sample first chapter, my uh, agent shopped that to several publishers, got interest from five, and uh, we narrowed it down to two, and then finally chose Tyndale House Publishers, and uh, that's how we got started. But that's what inspired me, was uh, Dr. LaHaye's view, and uh, the rest is history, as they say. <laughs>